Let's start off this Saturday morning with a midweek storm update. We continue to monitor a storm system that will be affecting the Great Lakes region Tuesday through Thursday. Now, this is the conventional GFS model, and it is leaning towards mainly snow for us, and that would be Wednesday and Thursday, really not showing a lot in the way of precipitation on Tuesday. Take a look at another model in our toolkit, and there are many. This is the GEM model, and it is also now leaning towards the storm being a little farther to the south and bringing us some snow Wednesday and Thursday. So I think right now if we see any precipitation at all on Tuesday it would be rain but a more southern track of the storm itself favors snow for Wednesday and Thursday but there's still lots of time for changes so watch for updates as the midweek period approaches. On the weather map today, not a lot going on in the Great Lakes region. We will start this day off with some sunshine, but an area of low pressure going into the northern Great Lakes will bring some clouds in this afternoon and maybe a flurry or two tonight. So we put the map into motion and notice any precipitation across the state today, tonight, and tomorrow is not expected to amount to much. The big news is the cold air that we have in place. Our forecast for today, increasing cloudiness, not much in the way of a wind. It is a chilly day, a high of 21 degrees. Tonight we've got clouds. It will not be as cold as this morning with a low of 13, maybe a flurry or two in the area tonight. It's time now to take a look ahead on Sunday, mostly cloudy, a high of 28 degrees. Monday, we're partly cloudy with a high near 30. Right now, Tuesday, it looks like some afternoon rain showers, a high of 41. And then Wednesday, all signs are leaning towards snow right now, and it will be an accumulating snow, a high near 30. More snow on Thursday, a high of 21.